Uh, tell me what brought you here today, why you're concerned about your sinuses. What sort of symptoms have you been having? Well, I had chronic um, infections constantly, um, at least six times a year. I would have mm -hmm. to miss work this past 12 months about eight times. Okay. And at least eight days because of the sinus pressure and it also caused fever. It would go into bronchitis, it would go it, just a lot of problems. I couldn't enjoy my vacations. Vacations, every time I to go on vacation, I'd always get sick. Taking always. antibiotics each time you get sick? Antibiotics, yes, each time. I was on over the counter medications, uh, antihistamines, um, I'd say about 32 weeks out of the year. Mm -hmm. All right, Joan, I'm going to take this packing out. Um, this has been soaking for a few minutes to get you nice and comfortable. And what we're going to do is we're going to put a little uh, numbing medicine up under your lips and also inside. And uh, we've got a little bit of numbing medicine soaking here, and we're going to inject that area. Then we're going to put the catheter um, in this area under your lip, and, um, and then the balloon goes through the catheter. So the first thing I'm going to do is a little bit of local anesthetic right here. Okay. Did that hurt much? No, just a little. Okay. Okay, we're going to inject a little more local anesthesia in there because you were feeling uh, some awareness of the endoscope. And I'm going to try to inject right at the front and back of the turbinates and as close to the area of the maxillary opening as possible. A little local anesthetic right in there. So, Joan, I'm going to put um, uh, this trocar um, under your lip in that area that we've anesthetized. Do a little bit of pressure while this goes in. Okay, so we're going to insert the camera into your nose. And then there is the opening to the maxillary sinus. We'll take the balloon. There in your sinus. You can also look. Injury. But we see that, that the, the area in here has been opened. And where the balloon is coming from, right through there. Okay, this comes out, and that's how it's done. How was that? Good. Very good. You ready to do the other side? I'm ready. Ready to go. Okay. Go to the upper lip. Pops in there. Do the wiggly a little bit. Comes out. Alright, so I'm going to put the camera in the sinus. see in the distance is sort of a slit like configuration to it. Open that up until it's a circle. You can see it's pretty 
comes wide or narrows down. Very small slit. Talk away. I had uh, friends that had the more invasive procedure, uh, similar to what I've just done, and um, from what they tell me, the, the, the time loss of work and the pain they had gone through in recovery time, uh, that this, you know, I could brag about it, go to them and tell them, hey, you know, this is just the, this is the ticket, this is the thing that you should do. Great. Well, we will look forward uh, to seeing you back in follow-up and, uh, and seeing how, um, how these symptoms improve over the next year. Oh, I'm sure they will. <laughs> Thank you. All right. You're welcome.